enjoy it. Wake up in the morning, think about all the things that you're happy for. And for me, what I've learned over the last couple of months, that if you are feeling down for any reason, it may be that you want to feel loved, I want to feel secure, I want to feel safe, I want to have something to laugh about. If you simply ask the universe, I just want to feel secure, because maybe <laughs> you might not have been feeling secure, and your, the way that you feel changes from day to day, week to week, mm -hmm. month to month. I just want to feel secure. Mm -hmm. I can promise you that could use me for example because I know that she said that's the way it works and I know that the universe will deliver it to me. I know that I will have security and I promise you the security will show up as long as you believe it. Mm. The universe will bring it to you. Mm. It will give you reasons to feel secure. Mm. I just want to have I just want to be happy. I want to have some fun. I want something to laugh about today. Mm. Just wait and see what happens throughout the day. And when you get it, say thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Those are the biggest words you can ever say. Thank come on, you. Come on, baby. Because if you come don't on. say thank you, it's like, well, she didn't appreciate that. Well, why mm. should I give her more? Yeah. 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 That's how it works. That's how it works. Yeah. The little things, mm. people say are coincidences, there are no coincidences. Mm. Acknowledge those little things, write them. If you really want to increase the power, get in the diary, write all the things that have happened to you today, and you'll think, ooh, that was interesting. So when you then have a bad spell, or you think you're having a bad spell, look back and see all the things that you've written down. Mm -hmm. That's the way, one way of increasing your belief. Belief. And, um... In terms of workshop, will you be doing a new workshop? I'm putting together a soulmate workshop. Mm. It seems to be a big need for that. Mm. I'm loving putting it together. I am just uh, sorting out the venues and the date at the moment. Okay, that's great. Because um, obviously you have um, Des O'Connor who does all stuff around relationship as well. How do you track a good um, black, black man? man? Yeah, mm -hmm. you know, it's probably mostly um, women, well obviously it's women. Black women, um, and he's you know he's very successful. Mm. You know he's really good at numbers, and then he's you know he's working hard. He knows hard. his stuff. He knows his stuff, and you know and I've, and I've kind of gravitate towards Desert Connor because you know he's it's a character. You know mm. he's, he's one of the lads, so to speak. You know what I mean? I just like his energy. You know, so and there's people like you now, right? Who's doing things now? So it's it's happening. Mm. It really is happening. Well, as we know that this is the um, in fact this is your life. <laughs> I would say this is your life. This is the um, the philosophy and supreme wisdom of Margot, and she's sharing her her journey, her life story, and it's not enough, you know. I mean, we have to get more of you, um, Margot, because I mean, one thing we need to talk about. The whole thing about um, God, and the whole thing about love, you know. We want to get back in there, talk, you know, talk more about those areas there, and get some clarity in, in that. But. Um, you know, it's really been a, a great uh, experience uh, having you here. And um, Margo, bless. Thank you. You're truly blessed. Thank you so much. Give that. Thank you. That's fine.